the Hackintosh project. Um, this is an old laptop that was about to get retired. It's a bit long in the tooth. Um, I'm running an old GeForce 3600 Core 2 Duo and uh, not Windows Vista anymore. Um, Apple doesn't support Blu ray, so I couldn't get that working, but um, the rest of the drive actually works. Just a standard um, PC. Sorry, I'll zoom back a little bit while it's doing it. It's slower than on an actual Apple because I think it has to um, it loads up some of the fake drivers or something before it gets going. Um, and that's also not exactly the fastest laptop in the world. But this is um, OS X 10.6.8, the latest edition of Snow Leopard. Um, and it runs fine. As far as I can tell, everything's working. So you've got. Um, so all the updates and everything are working fine. You can go software update, but I'm not going to bother for now. Um, and I installed obviously a couple of. Um, of apps and put office on it and all the rest. Whoops. So I've got to get used to the interface. Um, right, so a couple of games on there for the kids. Mm. Do, because everything seems to be running pretty much the way it's supposed to. Interestingly enough, the zoom in and out is two keys and you can move back and forward and what happens, this touchpad doesn't actually support multi-touch under Windows. Installed Apple, Apple says that it has multi-touch and as you can tell, it does. So, um, let's zoom back and shoot a birdie or two. Oopsie. <laughs> hey, one go. How good am I? Anyway, let's get out of here. Oops. And of course, the other thing I um, installed was iRhino, or whatever they're deciding to call it now. Confused the shit out of me about where this thing's um, keyboard was. Uh, not keyboard, uh, the command line. So, um, it all s seems to work fairly well. The command line actually shows up as soon as you start typing. Oops, there it is. Um, everything seems to be working pretty much the way it should. Anyway, I hope that's useful to someone. Cheers.